Hi guys, we're from the Craft Sisters. If you're new to this channel, we'd love you to hit the subscribe button below, put on the notification bell, and like this video. Also, comment in the box below who can make the best marshmallow challenge. What you'll need for this challenge is Rice Krispies. The amount is your choice. Marshmallows. The amount is also your choice. And one bar of chocolate. Because we are two people, we took two batches of each ingredient and made it a challenge. Of course, it can also just be a treat. I chose a threesome and my sister chose a midnight dark chocolate. This is our contest corner. We just put this plank here so we don't see each other's business. Start by putting your pots on the stove. Add your butter and all the marshmallows you like. Mix from time to time. As you can see, it's starting to melt. They're at the bottom of the pot. There you go. So when this happens, you put it the temperature down, but it doesn't burn. You put it on about about three. Then um, let's just open this and see that it's not poison. Doesn't seem like it. <laughs> so this is what I got when I opened mine. It's broken. So good to eat. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to graze my chocolate now. Block of chocolate, only one block. And then and I'm scooping some of the hot marshmallow into this bowl. What I'm doing is I'm going to throw some of my rice krispies into the big bowl. So I've got my rice krispies in a bowl and I'm just going to scoop some of this nice mellowy delight into the bowl. So after it's mixed in like and really well, as you can see, there's still chocolate. So we're mixing in. I'm going to add another block. We just use the marshmallows that you get in a normal store. So I'm just going to go ahead and mix this really up. Yo, this is chewy. It's like a pasta. All right, let's scoop it in here. Okay, so you, clearly you can see here's the plank. So the butter trick is kind of working because I'm getting the goo off here. It doesn't stick to my fingers anymore because of the grease to the, to the butter, which we want. So I'm taking some butter on my fingers so that what I'm gonna do now, take more marshmallow, put it in here and will not stick to my fingers. I'm going to scoop some of the mixture right over here into my first mold. So I added a chocolate in here. As you can see, and now I'm burying the treasure even deeper. Well, I added some butter to the pot over there, as you can see, and added some Rice Krispies. I am going to start mixing this in. Now, we're taking some chocolate and adding that, putting that into the microwave. Okay, so I'm actually going at a speed here, filling so many that I can't keep up with them. So that's what's going on here with me. Now let's see what's going on here. I filled, after I put the chocolate in the bottom of the mold, it's this one, I filled it and now, to your surprise, I'm adding more chocolate to the top of my mold. We took a Rotherly pie mold and I want to make a crispy cake. Nice. Now let's smear this with a little bit of butter. Okay, so I'll smear my hands with butter. I'm going to get this. Okay? And I'm going to take some of this and I'm going to roll it into little balls. Then I'm going to take one of these right over here. I'm going to 
stick it in here. Like that. We are going to take some of this and we are going to just lightly top it up with chocolate. But for now, stick out extra chocolate flavor. We're just going to spread the leftovers from our bowl. So this is now going to the freezer. I'm just going to put my cake in the freezer. Okay, we are going to make a huge bowl. Okay, so we are going to take this huge bowl and we're just going to work with it. Take our ball, take our stick, and put our stick into this huge ball. Now let's put this in the microwave. And I'm just rolling it out like this in my hands because you have to make a ball before you can make a square. Okay, so you see I've got the chocolate here. While it's in the freezer, I'm just gonna enjoy a chocolate snack. I forgot to put a stick in this one, so why don't go and snack too? Now we're starting to make it a square. without breaking it, like this one. I'm first going to start arranging mine in a ring. 